Oh crap. Oh no. What do we do? Oh no. You're his dad. You gotta do this. Just put an end to it, man. I'm sorry. Shit. I think I should have taken the gun. Dude. Do it! Sure, there's an option to give him a hug. Perhaps I shouldn't have done that. Oh god! I think I've made the wrong decision. This is... I don't know what decision there was to be made there. I don't know whether I was wrong or right. I don't know. I just don't know. No. Well, you hear me now, Clem. You uh, understand what happened? Yes. Okay. What do you think it's about? What Chuck said. What Chuck said? That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he did? I swear. Sorry. I took some sense into it. Don't be mad. Oh, I'm gonna be mad. How dare you? Hey, how you doing? Don't talk to my girl. Just stay away from her. Excuse me, son. I heard you told her she was gonna die. That she was gonna end up like Duck. Why'd you go and do that? Cause she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? I figure it out. Well, get to figuring, because it'll be on top of us before you know it. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. Hmm. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. <laughs> She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. Yeah, uh-huh. I don't He's... see how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die... Wow, she is... Yeah, he kind of talked some sense into me. Plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. Huh. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Sorry oh, wow. to hear that. No one to blame. 14 years? You're homeless then. Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and they just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. 
<laughs> Kenny ended up shooting his son out there. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Yeah. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean, when we get to Savannah. <laughs> we'll have a talk when we Where are you headed? Oh, about so whether or not in the direction the train is going. Be safe up here. You betcha. That's uh, that's pretty funny. I like that. Where are you headed? Um, that way. Hey, hey. It'll be good to get to the water. You still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Kim. Hmm. It's the best plan. Hey. Yeah. Um. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. That's, uh, that's a map, Split isn't it? Maps and documents. Yeah, let's uh, let's I grab it. Buy you for a second, Kenny. Can you just leave me alone? You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. I I need to get it. Get out of here. What's your problem? Uh Hey, Ben. I need to get hey. mine. Huh. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. There aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude, if he sticks around. Well, uh... We're all homeless. You know what I mean. There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah, I guess not. <laughs> See you. Yeah. Well, I need to, to get to the maps, so... Uh... Mind if I get by you for a second, Kitty? Can you just leave me alone? So I can go round for that, but... I'll uh, talk to you later, Kitty. Just reach over! You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. Hmm. It appears that I can't, because... Kenny just doesn't want to move. Door to the boxcar. What an ass. Okay, uh, what's this? Looks like Chuck has some booze left. Huh, pick it up. It's a fifth of whiskey. What's that? Blood stain. I hope we're not on this train much longer. Uh Aha, scissors. They look clean enough. He's lived here a while. Clam? Come here. Clint? Did you talk Drink to some him? Drink whiskey and then I cut did. your face. I some, mean, yeah. <laughs> uh, he explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not going to let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay, what should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan. For <laughs> well, first of all, we're gonna you cut your hair. Protect yourself and uh, tidy up a little, so you can't get grabbed so easily. I like that. Good. Okay. Uh. You need to know how to protect yourself. 